Welcome to the Keepers of the Golden Gate, session 15, I think we're on now. It is the 9th of August 2019. I am Ryan the GM, here are the players. I am Eric Greenwood playing Callum the Sorcerer. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Too fast. You're so confident! <laughs> That's getting in character, by the way. Really yep. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in danger! <laughs> 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 yeah, let's just run with that. That's fine, right? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Good enough. One in the snow. <laughs> Hi, this is Adrian. I play Arya Bluebird, who is a half elf druid. Sorry for the delay. I was uh, struggling with a laughing slash coughing fit there. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm Sophie. I play Kayla Kill, also known as the John Wick of D and D, and I'm a Tabaxi rogue. <laughs> Oh no. Please stand Rip. by while we try to connect to Technical difficulties. Drink. And no wait, we're not at a convention. <laughs> and difficult technical issues. Right. It would be really funny if Crumbar just barges in and we're like, oh, okay. <laughs> Glug. I'm back, sorry. Welcome um, back. Still doing the intro, yeah. Yeah, go for it. Hello, I'm Stuart. Play Reach Half Elf Mom. Perfect. You're a tiny bit quieter than normal as well, so I'm just gonna put the audio uh, I don't. Don't. Mike's, is no. that better yeah, now? We're, we're, we're fixed. Yep. Yeah. Great. I Excellent. turned you up for the intro now. I put you all the way back down to where you were for your normal <laughs> audio. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. We're here. Um, anyone that's listening, we're down Scott until he appears at some point. So who knows when that will happen? Good luck us and our ears. Um, until then, we'll just carry on. Uh, who remembers what happened last time? Magic. I walked into a room with strange men doing a strange deed. <laughs> I like your use of the term room, but yeah. <laughs> yeah, well. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yes. yeah, but before that we killed things. Yeah, yeah you did. I think of people doing strange things. Including a crazy worm-like thing. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yeah, we, worm. Tra- that that no. thing I can't pronounce. Yeah. Worm. It is worm. Worm. Yeah. Oh, worm. That's it. I mean... I the worm. Yeah. You just don't know specifically what it was. Like, Arya, when she did her nature check, said this was a dragon once. So, mm. realistically, if she had shared that to you guys, it's a dragon. Or was. That's fine, because we reached, beat the crap out of it. Mm-hmm. I think everyday helped, quite frankly. Because, yeah. I mean, yeah. you el- electrified it quite a bit. <coughs> you know, our, our druid actually hit things with her bow very well. And... <laughs> And you know, I kept people alive, so... Okay, obviously our John Wick tank just obviously took the beating for the team, stood back up, shot a lot, hit a lot. <laughs> uh, <laughs> we know how it works now, okay. And, uh, and obviously our monk didn't die, which I was surprised Amazing. about. Amazing. Um, <laughs> reminds me. 15 hit points I've got, right? Okay, <laughs> I was just checking what was that. <laughs> oh yeah, that's not... Uh, time yet. <laughs> yeah, that definitely is time yet. Um, yeah, so he's he's killed the big dragony thing uh, quite well and successfully and yeah, thumbs up for me. you uh, fought some other kind of former people, I guess I'll say. Yeah, former people. The hand mouth people. Um, fought more of those. Decided to just start running through the abyss ran for um, weirdly several hours, but yet seemingly like minutes. Um, strange. And then he's got to, as you said, Arya noticed you were starting to run on some kind of black marble at the under your feet. He turned around and realised that these things weren't following you. Onto it. I notice all the things. Yeah, yeah. With your nat twenty perception check, and then him. Um, yeah, so as you got onto this kind of black marble flooring, the hand mouth people never quite made it onto this. They just stop, which was curious. You obviously then turn around, as you do, you stare at the thing, and then you're in the room, as Stu put it. Dun-dun-dun-dun! Uh, this one, um, which had some interesting... Uh, lighting conditions um, mm. but before we do that 
That's just a wee sneaky peek. Oh. Um, before we do that, let's talk about goals. Always believe in your soul. I don't think anything would have changed, right, guys? Yeah, I don't think it has yet. Yeah, I don't, I, I don't believe we've changed yet. Kitty? I'm still believing in assholes. Kitty, who is indestructible? Oh. <laughs> oh, sorry, I was, didn't realise I was muted. I'd say the same as the rest of them, like, still doing what we're doing. That was so close to Scott's style of RPing there, was it? I would say the same as the rest of them. <laughs> 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 I haven't, but I would. Well, Channeling <laughs> him because we miss him. Yep. That is what it is. Hurry back to us, Scott. You petrol-lacking biker, you. <laughs> but <laughs> it was really hard to say correctly that quickly while ad-libbing. So, here we are. Um... Yeah, I'm happy we're leaving the goals as they are. It makes sense. Which is currently yeah. find out what's happening at the abyss and return from the abyss. The abyss, the abyss, the abyss. Um, abyss, abyss. Right Can I just check? Obviously, I don't know how loud that is from my end. Do you guys hear the like noises of the roads next to me? No. Because I've just had to open no. the window. Okay, that's fine. As long Not as it's without them bothering people, that's fine. No, this is basically what it is. I just hear the odd car going We're past. We're probably more likely, based on this audio bitch. test, to have heard the cars from Callum while muted, since Callum's been <laughs> 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 True. <laughs> um, okay, that's fine. I was just checking. Good, that's good. Fine. So anyway, back in the game, and where <coughs> we were. Let's go back. Since we've discussed goals, we're all good there. Bam! Mm -hmm. Dun 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 dun. Which, getting back to my point, really is the kind of thing that guys should do in a locked room. But anyway, that's. <laughs> what's the. What's the feeling right now as we cut in to this? Uh, you just you just stopped running, you have noticed these things behind you aren't following you? They're just there's standing? A, there's a red dementor in front of us. <laughs> there's a red dementor! Now you've put that image in my head. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. And then there's three shady dudes all the way at the top, looking like they're going to sacrifice themselves to Satan. Looking like they're going to sacrifice themselves to Satan. What a statement. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> well. So, you have, like, you know, a moment to catch your breath, and by that I mean, like, literally a moment to exchange, like, brief thoughts. What's mm -hmm. going through every of these heads? <laughs> We're fucked. Is that uh, just... This is not the <laughs> toilet. Must be the wrong room. Okay. <laughs> Sorry to interrupt. <laughs> uh, we'll just be uh, going now. Bye. This isn't the bathroom. <laughs> oh dear. But yeah. So. Can we tell anything about them? Like. Like what? You know, racial features. Are they as you know? Tumorous as the rest of the things would we you like to roll right perception after. yes please um just a moment i just wasn't sure if from that distance i'd be able to discern anything but yeah well, what is it you're looking so who is it you're perception. who are you trying to discern first well i was initially thinking the closest one to us but they seem to be like armored and whatever so, so like these dudes I th yeah, either those or the guy in the middle, the weird dementor like thing. Right, so how far uh, away are these things? Because this is where it's debatable what type of check it is, whether it's disadvantage or not. Just 125, that's fine. <laughs> this guy's 150. Feet. Yep. What's so that in meters? That's like 50 meters. If you're within 60 feet, it would not be for you a disadvantage. Yeah. You have to I'm squint your eyes. Dude. Yeah. Yeah, okay. So uh, that's not a okay. good thing. That's fine. But so Eric I... puts a torch out. Anyway. <laughs> 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 I'm pretty sure they're doing it. It's fine. <laughs> I need to see. This is when I need the natural to. Oh, okay. Not that bad. <laughs> you need to roll again, remember? <laughs> oh, I need to roll again. Disadvantage, Lil. Disadvantage, yeah. Oh, shit. Go ahead, oh, <laughs> oh, no. Right. Oh. So, uh, what you see is, uh, let me see. They're human-like. <laughs> oh, that's not the button I wanted to push, and I don't know if that changed anything on the map, so we'll just have to wait yep. to see. Yep, oh, there's good. a guy that's moved. Yep, let me just, there we go. Uh, let's see. That's the one, though. That's what you see. 
Okay. So. Huh. So you can tell these are people in yeah, with, in armor. A mask. Yeah. Cthulhu masks. Oh, come on. It They're really like cool a, masks. Looks like a dragon. Yeah. Can I, can I sense if there's any uh, magic shenanigans going on? How would you do that? Or feel. How Could I feel the, it, whether there's a big magic aurora like coming from in front of us? Like, is it heavy like when we met um, the Great Gold Worm? No, there's nothing like that here. Nope. You, don't, you don't have that nope. vibe. If you have Detect Magic, for example, you could use that. But, but no, there's no, can I feel any weird change in pressure vibe? No. I would have told you that straight away. Yep. Because it's not really you doing anything to notice that, if that makes sense. Yeah. It's, it's, it's like... kind of, it, it's like, oh, I step into the river. Cool. But the river is cold. Okay. You don't need to roll perception for that. So. Sure. Right, so we've had... Are you do that? Eric, was there anything else you wanted to try then, since you spoke next? I mean, we all have eyes, just saying. I mean, yeah, I, like, I, can I see what this, like, this portal Dementor red man is doing? Can I not see that? Am I squinting too hard? Is there not enough light? Is it just like a, sh like a shadowy figure? Uh, right, so that thing in the middle, member, I think I showed you this last time. Um, let me find the exact thing again. Show two players. Foupois! This beautiful piece of art. Um, that's the thing in the middle. Steps up um, to like this weird circle with the figure in, in the center. Oh uh, yeah, Stargate Abyss, I remember. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, can I like see what the Dementor dude is? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that one isn't actually a um, disadvantage, weirdly, because of the fact that they're illuminated. Ah, cool. That's perception. Which is I... ironic, because you're the one with the worst eyes out of the two of you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's not focus on the term ironic, but yeah. Uh, uh. I know, I know. Uh, yeah, so you see this thing. Holy shit. It's one of them, not multiple, just so you can. <laughs> Throw in the middle. They look like they're going to eat my soul. Mm. So and they it, turn it into a, like a little boo candy. So it looks like it's a figure about maybe eight, nine feet tall, give or take. You can't really tell that much from this distance. But it's maybe about nine feet tall. Um, and it seems to be like made of like red, red kind of smoke, energy, plasma, something like that, you know, kind of tumbling red. <laughs> uh, it just looks like a big kind of tall red, I guess, dementory looking thing. Is it looking at us? Can I tell that? Uh, no, it's kind of like looking towards the, uh, you know, the further thing that's happening. The red glowing. Ah. I, I, I doubt I can make sense of what's going on there, right? Nah, you can't. Cool. Yeah. No, there's, right. kinda, no, there's kinda too much in your way to like kinda really see beyond what you've seen so far. Like that that creature is at least up high, so you could spot that easier. Um but yeah. Uh, right, okay, so what about Oh wait, does it have legs or is it floating? Uh so it looks like it's um like someone in a big, big long cloak almost. Uh, with a big like ah. big hood etc. But it's all red and flowing and you know, smoky and whatnot. Wait, is the mod dude in front of us? Like what? The torch does not illuminate. So what is Reach or Kitty thinking? Um Still thinking to get away with the guy with front with the torch lit, but <laughs> Just stepping to the side into the darkness. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you can tell me to put it out. Yeah, or you could just, like, hit it with your fist and sure knock it out. what happen. It's like watching a slow motion accident. You just... <laughs> 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 I'll just go in there and go, Sup, guys, how's it? how are we all doing? Hmm. 
walking there like I own a place, then nothing suspicious, right? If I walk in there like I own a place, people are like, yeah, he's, got, he's meant to be here. He's confident. <laughs> <laughs> he can't speak properly, but he's confident. Oh, are you okay? <laughs> What's the plan? Hmm? Well, I get my crossbows out. <laughs> <laughs> Well, just the one. I mean, yeah, one. For now, just the one. For now. For now. Until you start <laughs> investing in like holsters on your hips and such. <laughs> yeah. Kitty LaCroft. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Can we move at the moment as well? Or um, just... If that's the thing that you want to do in your moment of taking like a, a kind of action, you, you, you could like, you could move up 30 feet if you wanted. Yeah. But that's kind of like the instinct to that is everybody runs in, Arya stares at that guy, Eric stares at the big kind of red guy, you go potentially run ahead and then turn and go, wait, why did nobody else keep running? And then obviously Kitty stops and pulls out a crossbow. Why it was ever away, I don't know, but. <laughs> yeah. So you probably still maybe have a crossbow. Maybe just to run quicker. Out. Yeah, maybe, yeah. I like the video game logic there. Putting the weapons away means I run slightly faster. Good. <laughs> <laughs> the aerodynamics. I've <laughs> <laughs> gained point zero zero one kilometers per hour. That would definitely won't Every, be that in this game. Kilometers per hour. <laughs> you metric boy. <laughs> I do still want to get a bit closer. Yeah. The, the thirty on my full move is forty. What? Uh, no, like yeah, your full actual move. Yeah. All right. So okay, okay, cool. I will move that forty. Okay. Cool. So you I'm head a bit for it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Into the darkness. Dum 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 dum. Right, so. Let me. God, I've got no key. Half health. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're both kind of screwed. Yeah, so. Can. Everyone. Roll Roll initiative. initiative. Did they spot me, or was it just in general? We'll see. I'm so proud of you to You collect your token. <laughs> I didn't, yes. <laughs> no, I've dropped my pen. <laughs> oh no. Yeah! Bonus from not, uh, for not clicking my token. The good news is, there's probably nobody else nearby, so make as much noise as you want. I can't uh, make that much noise at the minute, unfortunately. Uh, yeah. Let's just let's just let's just answer that question though. There are loads of the kind of abyssal people behind you. Loads. Yeah, but they're all too scared to come out. So yeah, okay. oh, like no. literally, they just don't seem to be able to step onto the big kind of marble floor. Are they Maybe trying? It Maybe it melts them. Uh, no, like they literally just have walked up and stopped. See a holiday in Spain round the swimming pool. That is marble, and the ants would never walk on it. But they always walked around it. So the same kind of idea then. If uh, by that I mean yeah. there's a thing that people aren't walking on, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Not saying that these are in any way related to ants in any way, yeah. but you know, some may have been uncles. We don't know. We don't know who these people were. <laughs> Far distant cousins, <laughs> twice removed. Also, whoever was laughing, at, please don't. Like it's, it was so bad. Um, yeah. And to be fair, if any of them were family relations, I'm sure you'd have noticed the extra mouth in the hand, but anyway. Oh, you think that, but whew, families. <laughs> um, right, this let's is why they were removed. Yes, that's true. Right. So, let's see, has that everybody got an initiative? Good, good, good. Crumbar is probably saying something like, by the beard of the golden worm, or something like that, because that's exactly how Crumbar <laughs> sounds. Um, well, like, yes. me smash! Crumbar smash, and then you mean. <laughs> uh, right, so, you step forward, reach, you yeah. you head forward, you kind of like, see this, like, ensemble of people, um, you can kind of vaguely hear chanting, something you're yeah. well used to overhearing, um, probably alarm clocks for you quite frankly in your in your monastery and whatnot. Um but you vaguely hear chanting. Not enough to make out, like it's you just know it's off in the distance. Um and then as you like walk forward, uh, some of these guards spot you. And by guards I mean generic term. Um they 
turn round because all of them seem to be facing this whatever is going on at the back uh, and then you just hear uh, the guards shout for the king as they start to move towards you mm-hmm. by that I mean narratively they haven't got a go yet but they will and they are moving <laughs> um, Eric when they say for the king uh, you can you just can almost not hear that based on the distances and whatnot, right? But you can mm-hmm. see the figure on the in the circle, if you will, at the top of the uh, like in the steps, turns to look towards the party. Just oh, when, yeah. and it's that is in timing. The audience would know that happens at the same time those people shout for the king when they spot reach. Yeah. So, we hope so, guys. So, Eric, oh, what do you do? Horrible next turn. Let's see. Mm. My God, I cannot move. Yeah, it's a big area. This map is like a tenth of the size I wanted it to be, but I realized I had to just go for um, what makes sense, like yeah. computer-wise, not what should be what I envisioned. <laughs> <laughs> um. Okay. The map looks cool, from what I can see. Um, can I just ready it to an attack if any of them come into my like my light radius? Any of the enemy guards? Can I ping? So, what is your attack? Do you mean like a melee? Just attack shoot them with crossbow. No, ping them with crossbow. Um, I mean technically they're in your range now. Do you mean like a specific range or? Uh, my light radius. Are they in my range though? Mm. They are. I could take a ping. <gasps> I could even hit that guy. Disadvantage or is it advantage? 120 of it is my range. I, mean, I, I recommend the guards. guards. Plus, the good thing is, disadvantage doesn't stack, which is great. So, if you're already at disadvantage, yeah, there's. Yeah, you know what I mean? It's the nice thing about 5th Ed. I say that like there's not much next to 5th Ed, but it's. Looking this boy with my crossbow. They don't look friendly. They look like they want to attack. Right. So well, there's something else, by the way. Here, before you do this, can I mm-hmm. just reword? Yeah. Right. They said for the king. Acts more than likely the wizard king. We've got something that the wizard king wants. Are we willing to trade the boy for our lives? I would. Crumbar's a man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that is cool, but that's just like the king wants him. <laughs> we barely want him. Wow. <laughs> savage! <laughs> Somebody took that savage attack feet early. <laughs> uh, and handing over the Black Fang spear, 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 I'm spear sure, yeah. uh, might be the right move. So you want me to call out to him instead? He'll be like, we have something you want. I just don't know what handing over a kid. Well, we're not in range of them attacking us unless they've got range attacks. Yeah. <laughs> That's such a great statement, isn't it? <laughs> we're not in range of their attacks unless they have ranged attacks. <laughs> oh, yeah. Eric, oh. the best general. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> Fantastic. Any ideas, ladies? <laughs> I don't know what Callum thinks. Throw the boy at him! Yeah, it's, it's probably a good moment to, like, let's take a week, uh, uh, like a time out, if you will. And, yeah, so Stu has posed, for the king could mean the wizard king. You have Ermos, and it now seems that Reach's plan was take everyone to the beautiful Golden Citadel, look how safe and blissful and well equipped this place is, let's pretend the boy can stay here, take him to the abyss at the last minute. And then hand him over to what looks like dodgy guard guys with spiky faces. <laughs> Is Reach evil? <laughs> yes, yes. Pr- purely pragmatic. <laughs> Said every villain ever. Um, except maybe the Joker. I'm going to word the real world to St. Christopher or whoever it is. I can't remember what his name is. Who's the one at the gates? I can't remember, but anyway. Yeah. That'll be a tough conversation. but It'll be fine. Ladies, uh, what, what do you think about throwing Eremos in their direction and running the other way? Well, 
that circular thing, like the summoning thing, it kind of could be how they change Eremos into the Black Fang Spear, like the actual thing. Yeah. So. Just turns uh, into a spear and falls on floor. Well, now we have a weapon. <laughs> no more kid, yay! <laughs> Yeah, I was going to say, I'm not surprised by Kitty's response. No, not at all. <laughs> or just Sophie's <laughs> response, quite frankly, at this point. Not Kitty's response, Sophie's response. Um, I don't know, because keep in mind, think of it obviously from your character's point of view, but this is like a player discussion we're having. Like, what is the plan as a group? Do you decide that... Right. See if the, if the boy is a weapon, then chucking him in the middle of the eye of the storm would be a good place to put him. Yeah, uh, it could... Uh, Trigger him. So that's the Crumbar uh, uh, train of thought, yeah. We know As... Crumbar would be aboard with us. Uh, yeah, he would, but we're, he's not here, so he doesn't have a vote. So we are just purely here, and it's an even number, so we need to have, mm. yeah, more than one. But then, I'm with you, Reach. But then, what about Celeste? Screw her, she ain't even showed up. Mm. <laughs> she gave us a dodgy vision, and that's it. <laughs> like we're on some kind of freaking drugs. That, to me, looks like a portal though, to places, and Celeste goes places, so it could be the same place. <laughs> <laughs> that bus goes somewhere. <laughs> I have legs that also go somewhere, and he has a car. We must all be fish. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they are fins, and they also yeah, go somewhere. right. <laughs> <laughs> gills, man. Gills. Speaking of gills, where is that guy? <laughs> I assume dead, but he didn't die on screen, so therefore he's probably not dead. Yeah, you know how it works. <laughs> <laughs> there was no like Wilhelm guess, scream as the rocks fell. Uh, I guess though we're not really all for the idea of just chucking him at the wolves then, no. uh, or I wasn't well, going to chuck. Him I was going to say, was gonna what's Arya's opinion on this, or should I say, just Idris' opinion, right? Because very uncharacteristically quiet. Well, I'm, I'm a bear. <laughs> I've not clue because like I don't know if there's any like they want the kid I think it's quite obvious that they do is and... it? oh yeah it's Sorry, not, it's not obvious at all to be honest but, I mean yeah. the only thing that Reach has heard is that they said for the king oh for the king okay that's it yeah. that's the only thing Reach has heard I thought you said they were eyeing the kid or something, and that's why we're all nope. arguing what we do with the no. kid. No, Reach is just yeah, debating um, whether or not to just go, we we have this child. Have it. <laughs> uh, but that does sound like arming the uh, the wizard king with yeah. the weapon, so I say, please don't. But, but to be honest, though, it, it also sounds like the wizard king has had the kid all along, and it's just now that we kind of stole the kid from him. So what so. would providing this kid to these potential Wizard King men I mean, do? They, they might want to kill us anyway. Um, but what I'm what I'm thinking is, I think that if the kid was an actual weapon that the Wizard King was thinking of using, that he would have done so already. He would have, mm -hmm. I don't know, activated the weapon potentially, or you know, kept him a lot more protected than he was. Mm -hmm. So I think that if the kid is an actual weapon, then uh, it, it, maybe the king isn't very fully aware of it. Hmm. So what I think would be happening here is, I, I don't know, I mean, either way the kid's going to have to stick with us, like hide behind Crumbar or something, but I don't know if he'll be able to, to do anything, he sounds quite scared of his own shadow, especially because he can't really see. Like, I think most of us can see quite well in the dark here, but he's human and he can't. The good news in the abyss, nobody no, has a shadow. <laughs> it's all dark. <laughs> <laughs> Everything is shadow, he'll, you mean? He'll, all, he'll constantly have to stay next to somebody that makes the little flame things. Well, essentially, Crumbar is going to be stuck with him until he appears, let's face it, for narrative yeah, reasons. Yeah. Um, yeah. That's yeah. what's going to happen. So we don't really need to worry yeah. about that if we don't want to. Uh, it's only if somebody says, I will take the kid, and then he doesn't fight, I guess. Um, but, we've already spoke about it for a bit. It's Eric's turn. Yeah. Eric. Right. Let's go for it, yeah. 
Hmm. So as you go forward, for fighting does, here, by the way. Oh. It's like does so you step forward. I don't know if Reach actually says anything to you, like verbally and character. <laughs> have have you described this to me? Uh, yes, he said for the king. I wonder if that's the wizard king. Uh, do you think you'd be looking for the Black Fang spear? Possibly. Do you reckon it's worth a try? I don't mind running up and trying to negotiate. I'm a bit wounded, but you can try it if it avoids a fight. I'd rather talk my way out to this. Yes, stay that. Yeah. Cool. I will walk forward. Two of us have outpointed, unfortunately, by the looks of it. But yeah. yeah. So you're gonna use the rest of your act, like your action, sorry, to dash up there. Can I not yell at him then? No, I'm just saying Probably. that you've already moved thirty feet, so you're next. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I would, I wouldn't, I wouldn't shoot or. Do that, I'd just be like, where were we? Let's speak. We might have something that interests you. Literally be uh, what I'd be saying. Okay, they still just look like they're moving towards you. Ah, huh. well. Yeah, yeah, it looks like they've split into their two groups now as well. Group one heading to you and group two heading to reach. Huh. Well, these guys don't want to speak. That or they don't like shouting. And unless they have monk movement or rogue movement, they can't get to me so we chill. This guy might have like some sort of like super AoE attack that's gonna one shot me. <laughs> I'm scared of that guy. I'm scared of that guy, I'm not gonna lie. He's big <laughs> scary. I've got no magic left. I just sat What's there. wrong with a nine foot tall plasma man? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he's red, I'm glowing and blue. That's like yeah. instantly contrast. Yep. Mm. Uh, right, okay, so no bonus actions there. Uh. Uh, I don't have, I can't do any. Like, they're all like based off like whether I've got a spell already out or if I'm about to cast a spell. So, no? Yep. Reach. Right, I'm definitely moving forward anyway, mm -hmm. not much is... Uh, where was that? Also for um, the narrative fiction of this, the black marble kind of circular floor is like a mile like radius, was my original design by the way, a mile radius, so yeah. This place is meant to be grandiose. Short sleep. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wake me up when they get closer. <laughs> so it literally would have taken us several turns to have gotten to him. Yep. Maybe a session's worth of just moving. <laughs> oh, I can't. <laughs> uh, so what's the plan there? Reach. Um, moving forward, I'm just trying to figure out exactly how, but yeah. <laughs> Okay, I'll stop there. Single movement. Mm -hmm. And I do think I'm going to take my potion of healing. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Is this your last, last one? one? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So it's I really don't want to click it. Walk yeah. forward, uncorks bottle, glugs, <laughs> throws the bottle away. Is right, it? I'm ready. I That's came here to good. kick ass and uh, drink healing potion. Yeah, it looks like yeah. I'm all out of healing potion. <laughs> 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 Had to be done though. And then you could hear. Oh, forgot. Uh, oh, yeah, so yeah, you wish. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, that was so bad. Nah, that's I'll not. That's not. Pitch. That's not bad. Six is okay. Twenty-one is disgusting, but six that's is okay. <laughs> Enough for my twenty-one now. But yep. Yeah. There you go. It was just predicting what you should do. <laughs> <laughs> this is what you will have. Oh dear. Um, I think you can code that so that when you click it, it will do that math. It's like the proper math. You should you should be able to code it as the attack roll. Yeah, is yeah. that um two d six two d four plus two? Uh, if you edit it. Um. Can you pointless now? But yeah. yeah, but <laughs> it's. I mean, you probably pick up more in the future, right? So. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, go there. Bonus action. I'm 
They haven't even said anything back yet, but okay. Nah, they mostly shouted and started moving. Right. I will shout out, we are here with the Black Fang Spear. But that's all. Okay, yeah. Cool, you shout that back at them. End turn. Right. So. Mm -hmm. I could be surrounded very soon. Yeah. <laughs> Can't do much to help you this time, unfortunately. Yeah. I was thinking that you're not. Yeah. That's why I sit. That's why I was like sixty-five feet away from. Him. I may have been 65 feet away from, but it only takes 60 to get into my range. Ah, ah I've been bit out of room. Yep. Um, so these these people, these armoured people, um, mm -hmm. they're mostly in, it looks like plates of armour, like say like a shoulder plate that's armoured, but then it's like black kind of robes that are like all kind of intricately woven down one arm. Um, so it's kind of like a weird cross between like nobility and armour. Um, or like a super expensive swanky paladin at a cocktail party and then like they've got their fancy masks on it's they've got like a hood up uh, behind the mask and they all draw scimitars as they walk forward like fancy kind of like almost kind of ornate looking blades that all match um, it's almost like a sun mask that as well in a way mm. okay so yeah they do that, and then they surround um, you, and they're kind of like holding you, so um, you know, like a sword point, as it were. Um, and then, as they get there, they then, like the the head of like each of those groups, if you will, the guys in the middle, essentially. Again, very hard to discern like who's who. They're all like kind of minutely different. Um, looking it's not like exact armor they've got it's almost obviously like it's a bunch of people that were given the outfit and then they customized it each themselves and the uh, the kind of man says why are you here uh we kind of just run in for Devis and uh he stumbled upon this place <laughs> you hear like one of them scoff from like your group calm also Reach, roll, insight. Cool. Insight. Cool. The one that you hear scoffing from Eric, the equivalent one for you, moves in the same way. As if, you know, he doesn't make the noise, but his face twitches the same way. I got you. Interesting. And the same question was posed to you, by the way, by the middle guy. Right. Uh, what my friend says could be true, or we're here to see what's happening with the land in this area. Is this poisoned? <laughs> the the guy to your right, I reach. He's like he can like gestures widely with one hand, and he's like. The abyss has warped this land for hundreds, if not thousands, of years. This isn't new. Speak the truth, interloper. And he kind of like holds out his scimitar, as if under your chin, you know. Uh. So, are we gonna tell the truth here? Well, that one said actually Kenny was the truth I'd have said, but okay. Yeah. Well, so, I mean, whether he believes you, right? Yeah. The thing is, we don't have any a lot of information about the abyss, right? We know not a lot of people return, so we can just tell them that, you know... There's, we there's, a, ca there's a camera cut to that table you've never cleaned up in the library, full of all this <laughs> research, and then it cut back to us. Yeah. <laughs> I have an idea. Well, just tell them, nobody has returned from here for hundreds of years, so, so actually we, we don't know. 
what is happening, yeah. So what is what is your like are you replying to him again, then Reach or yeah. Callum or whoever? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nobody has returned here from hundreds of years, so we don't actually know out in the world what is happening here. Why the land is poisoned. And then the one in front, like directly in front of you, um it's almost like you're like staring at the guy pointing the sword right at your kinda neck. And then the one in front says There is a reason for this. And you won't return either. And then, yeah, Kitty. Wow. I'm going to retirement home and hope. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, there's a hotel just out of range at the top left of this map. Uh, <laughs> everybody just stays there. <laughs> um. So they've just been surrounded. I, yeah. It's time to bring but out a crossbow and scimitar and rapier. <laughs> are we are we attacking them? Nah, well, at right, so ones that are high. what would Kitty feel like, right? So you can see them surrounded. They're at sword point. You know they're quite outnumbered. Eric's there with his torch of justice. You know, <laughs> I'm the shining beacon. <laughs> um, I mean, have they spotted the rest of us? Um, they seem focused on those two. Okay, because like I'd I'd sort of. Be more inclined to like sneak around and like just like go off that way somewhere and like just be a sneaky sneak. <laughs> Goodbye, in the dark. boys. <laughs> um, yeah, you can. Like, Talking is it working? It's your turn, so you act with your full suite of actions. Uh, I'm gonna go. Both actions, just gonna, just gonna. Well, you mean you're gonna go use, go use right your there. your movement and your cunning action? Yep. Okay. Uh, so I'm gonna. Oh no! I'm actually, click on the. Uh, so you'd yep. have to be one back. Oh. To walk that way. Yeah. Yep. It's fine. Just this is. Uh, let me see. Mine's is on hidden for some reason. Uh, this is like insurmountable. <laughs> Why is that still not showing? Uh, show. There we go. Nope, still not showing people. Show others, there we go. This is like insurmountable. So you'd have to have been from here, from like there. Ah, uh, okay. Just up to there, and then hence why you go there. Yeah. Cool. Okay, so I'm just gonna... You still got an action. Because that um, would have been your move and then your cunning action. Okay, well can I ready an attack in case anything comes near me? Uh, define near you. Wow, rude. Like, within the... well. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. <laughs> <coughs> if they come within 30 feet, I will shoot them with my crossbow. Cool. Type that into the chat as your reaction. Or like your prepared action or whatever. Okay. If you want to summarize it, you can do like P and then type whatever the trigger phrase is. Cool, and I'm assuming that is the, the end of my turn. Mask faces, not oh, just anyone. Yeah. Well, <laughs> the enemy, who we perceive as the enemy. Okay. Uh, right, are you? I turn towards, uh, like kind of like over my shoulder towards Crumbar and uh, and the kid, and be like, stay behind us. Stay safe, and then I move ahead like thirty. One, two, three, four, five, six. So that's we moved, and um, seeing that these guys have said that we're not getting out of here alive, I'm going to prepare a pew pew. Now, would you like to roll perception to see if you heard that? Oh, it doesn't exactly look non-threatening, right? But yeah. Well, if not, I would be prepared to just mm -hmm. in case. Um, perception, perception, perception. I just want you to be fully uh, aware when you're attacking. Yeah, no, absolutely, I agree. Oh, so that's still enough. 
That's still enough to know that. Yeah, so you Is heard it? that. Oh, yeah. Okay. yeah, the check was 10. Okay. It was not a difficult check. <laughs> sure. In that case, uh, I would be pretend. I would be preparing to pew pew the guy on the. I I still don't understand how combat works. Do, would any of them have an advantage against Calm from the from the uh, way they are? Standing? You wouldn't necessarily know that. Um, for example, I know that. they might have. The like, one right, there's no the one right in front of me then. So there's no flanking by default, <laughs> right? Um, yeah. which is maybe what you're kind of referring to. There's no flanking rules by default. However, it's not to say they don't have things on their character sheets that let them do fancy things, such as, um, like, gang up or something like that, you know? Again. Yeah, yeah. So. Okay, and... Well, I think the last thing you, the, the last thing we're saying is, like, let's talk about this, and then they said, you know, you're not going to walk out of here, so... I'm gonna take that as, as you know, pew yeah. pew motherfucker. Um, Come get on our so... giant eagles and fly out instead. Oh no, why are we being attacked? Yeah, I get yeah. you. <laughs> so I'll be using my short bow mm -hmm. to hopefully so attack the one right in front of me. Probably not. <laughs> right, so you're, you're opening volley, you see. Interesting. Well, yeah, they said we're not gonna get out of here. We're not gonna get out of here alive. And I'm Against this one, was it? Yeah. Cool. It yeah. was like... Hey, uh, you hit. Do I hit? Oh, <laughs> shit. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, God, what if they did not mean them? And, oh, God, I think I fucked this ball up for everybody, haven't I? Oh, typical Adri. Yep. Uh, you... Like, you do not speak this way to my friends. <sighs> Yeah, like I kind of like turn around and give her a glare. Like uh, this, this, I still had this in my pocket. So this arrow comes like <laughs> flying out of the bow, right past the uh, you know you hear that <laughs> past Callum's ear or Eric's ear, and then yeah. just kind of like sticks into like this guy's like kind yeah. of shoulder blade. Yeah, <laughs> he looks like just. It's like, fine. I've got healing. If it turns out that they're not enemies, I can heal him. Now, Eric, you're now um, there's a spray <laughs> of like <laughs> arterial blood. That covers you. <laughs> Ouch. Yeah. I'm gonna give her yeah, a good for that. Stay in my clothes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No. I. I just realized. Like after I was like, yeah, yeah, I'll attack. I was like, yeah, I. I probably shouldn't have done that. What if they didn't mean them? Well, actually, there's some good news. But you know, they have a weird red creature in the middle, and <laughs> those things were afraid of them. So I don't know. I'm just gonna assume that they're. You want to fight that? Baddies. <laughs> <laughs> and that I didn't fuck things up for everybody. Uh, what about bonus actions? Anything you want to do? <laughs> I heal the guy again. <laughs> I'm <laughs> sorry. I could. I just want you to let you know how much of a threat I can be. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing. No. No bonus. Sorry. Coughing. Coughing. Fit. Just no there. I had to <laughs> mute myself. Um. Um. I don't even know what I could have as a, as a bonus action other than <laughs> healing the guy. <laughs> so, if, unless you want to heal the guy, I'm, I'm assuming that's the end of your turn. Don't yeah. heal him, please. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, Eric. So well, you're covered in we're blood. We're icing out now. <laughs> <laughs> I think we just have that shot of like this guy like g grabbing at his like shoulder blade with his non-sword hand, and then like you're just blinking slowly as this blood sloshes <laughs> off you. <laughs> More like that. Yeah, that exact blink is for Adam. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Right, I guess we're, I guess we're fighting now. First of all, um, uh, Arya, mark off an arrow. <laughs> Cool. Well, well, well. Uh, yeah, carry on. I guess we're fighting now, so. Uh... Yeah, because I'm an idiot. Not necessarily. Uh, this th this, this totally might have been the right idea. It it might, it's also totally not what my character would do. I don't know. You've just been chased through a chasm of hell by like monsters. Yeah. It's, it seems fair. After recent history, I guess. Quite, yeah. Also, we actually only need to yeah, get each. Happy, each so. Meta game in here, so this fight's not going to be half as hard as well. I thought it was going to be. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, your four your four thousand XP monster you wanted to fight. Fifteen hundred. Yeah. Um, yeah. 
Well, due to the fact that the guy's now got an arrow sticking out of his neck or some shit, I've got to, like, I don't know, I guess we've got to fight, so... Mm -hmm. I'm gonna... You could always bring out your hanky and say, oh, sorry, you've got blood all over you there. <laughs> now, remember, this is somatic components, is it not? Uh, Thunderclap, because it's a clap. Yeah, it's somatic, so it's like, as I'm dropping the torch, it just clap. So, keep in mind, you have a torch and a crossbow. The crossbow is not equipped, because uh, game mechanics and that makes you run faster. Cool. Like, how, oh, I would have oh. run around with a two-handed crossbow and a uh, torch. Yeah. Can they not clap the crossbow against the torch and make it clap? <laughs> no. <laughs> Sadly not. His hands are full. He can't magically draw in the air with Microsoft Paint. I have other paint programs also exist probably. And then uh, yeah, so you drop the torch, let me unbind you from such a thing. Is that you unbound? Yay. The torch is free. It's a free torch. It's got a man in its own, kill it. <laughs> uh right, you were saying. Uh, yeah, I just I drop the torch and thunderclap because I have, I now feel like oh shit he's been shot. <laughs> the We're image you've got. Fine now. The image you've got is this arrow flies past. Arterial blood sprays all over you. The camera switches the angle from over your shoulder to like facing you over these guys' shoulders, and then it's just you blinking, and then the torch just gets dropped, and you just clap. <laughs> There's a little sigh in between dropping the torch and the blinking, like <sighs> clap. Right, so I need to make some con saves too. Okay, I so one. Gonna make all two, of them as well. Three. That guy. Dies. Oh, he's dead. Wait, what? 11 damage killed him? So, let me see if <laughs> I'm I can just gonna look, look at him. Look <laughs> Uh, you guys aren't tough. We just fought a dragon. You guys ain't nothing. So, like, as you clap, the, the kind of fancy robes of these people, like, billow. Um, the chains between the armour pieces all, like, kind of rattle a little bit. Uh, and that guy just, like, gets the brunt of it, I guess. Um, you hear, like, a crack on his shoulder and he falls over. Yeah. yeah. Uh, anything else? Um, um, no, I can't really do anything. Kind of out of sort of three points, just above half HP. Yeah. We're, we're looking brutal. So you're staring at them with like these glowing blue eyes and all these kind of lines over you, and you're just like, ah, <laughs> <Clap. It's> like, <laughs> <laughs> Did his body go flying? Oh, uh, no, nope. it's still next to me. Cool. It's not thunderclap. Doesn't do that. Does not. What did? It's only really wave that does that, right? Uh, yeah, it's a new wave. Oh, also, anything within 100 feet, so... I know. <laughs> I know. This guy ate it. <laughs> if he's got ears. <laughs> if he has ears. These are the best D&D conversations, aren't they? <laughs> uh, if that's you, Reach, you're up. You're up, buddy. You, uh, you oh definitely God, heard sure. that. Yeah, right. Boom. The guy to the right of me, he's not fallen down or anything, no? No, not at all. No. Doesn't right. even look like he's moved, actually. Did they not notice me? Did they not just look briefly? Oh, that's all narrative hmm. stuff that you don't have the time to pay attention to. Mr. Covered in Blood making loud bams. <laughs> I'm more perceptive than you think. Roll perception. We'll find <laughs> out. Right, if you get it, I'll tell you. <laughs> right, roll. Let's see. I told you I'm more positive than you no, think. I'll, I'll, like, no, I'll give you that. A 15? Yeah, I'll give you that. Yeah. They, um, I guess, like, their cloaks billow a tiny bit and they turn to look um, while, like, maintaining focus on their quarry. Give a little quick little glance. So, uh, yeah. Reach. We're still on you. Literally, it's that moment in a view cinema where it goes, BOOM! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, That's when you know we're fighting. <laughs> Take that one. They went to the right. Yeah. Cool. And I'll miss them with my core stuff. Oh, I didn't. No, you don't. Yeah. Uh, Good hit. Yeah, so like, you oh. can like, 
grab your quarter staff, swing it into like the guy's chest. He kind of like buckles over. Um, and you just hear him like exhale in pain. Yeah. Yup, yup. <laughs> like you've I'll just punch. winded a man, basically. Yeah, yeah. I'll punch that one. On the front? Just, yeah, in front. Okay. Top of me. Yeah. Definitely hits. Yep, yep. Good hit as well. Yeah, yeah right. punch him, feel the mask crumple a bit. Right, end turn. I'm hoping they talk, but we'll see. <laughs> so, the the one that's just been punched in the face spits yeah. to the side, and he says, "Dagger eared scum." <laughs> it's racist. The face, and then. <laughs> What? Like leans yeah. over Point his shoulder, uh, leans over his shoulder, and then it's like a. It's not quite a whistle, but it has the same resonance to it that he does with his lips, um, and it's this weird like vibration, uh, and then. Uh oh! He's summoning something. Maybe guys go in. Uh -oh. And then he turns back and looks at a uh, reach, and then a uh, he's just got a slight kind of like as if his teeth are gritted a little through all the blood, uh, where he's missing that one tooth. And uh, mm -hmm. right, the guy that you hit that's winded to the uh, the right, he's gonna make an attack. For pwa! Don't think that hits you, does it? It doesn't. No, seventeen. It needs to be cool. And then the guy at the other side. For pwa! It's all right. Then uh, yeah. we've got Team Eric here. Fupwa, uh, fupwa. <laughs> oh. There you go. A near miss, but yeah. Just like pound me, so he was off like no. Kitty. So reaction. You yeah, kind of good. your crossbow now is like oh. <laughs> yeah, almost disappointed. But like, they're really not good fighters, by the way, which is kind of strange, as if their job's not fighting. Mm, it's like sacrifice, <laughs> sacrificial lambs. Um, Plus three. Well, I guess I'll uh, move a little bit. Um, Stop for the math, this too. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Don't make me hide my rules. Um, <laughs> I'm going to move to the edge of this circle. Yeah. The thing that in my head is a mile radius? Yeah, go for it. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of moved Without there. Without mapping it, by the way, I'm just thinking the damage they've taken and died and, uh, yeah, the damage they've dealt out. Mm -hmm. None. Uh, yeah. So they're 40 feet away. What was my... 30, I believe. Thingy rain. You've moved 25 so far. Yeah, I could move over a little bit more. I mean, like, I've got my cunning actions, so I can move even further. You could also just, you could just use your racial trait as well and move double your movement. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I could do that. And you may as well do that once you've moved again. With I'd, your I'll just move uh, 15 feet. How are you so doing it, though? I need to know how. With a tap dance? No, what I mean is, <laughs> what, what specific <laughs> ability of yours are you using to do so? Is, uh, it, is, just is it your cunning action or my, your racial trait? My cunning action. Okay. I'll just use my cunning action. Cool. They work differently, it's why it's important. <laughs> okay. So I'm going to move three squares over. Okay. Oh, what? And then I'm going to... Gonna... <laughs> <laughs> then I'm going to attack this dude. Cool. With my crossbow. Mr. Windberg himself. Yeah. Uh, oh, well, I just gave myself I think, away. I think you f you shoot and then uh, it like pings off like his shoulder plate or something. You know, one that he's like you know wishing had been on the old other shoulder. <laughs> yeah. As it's all like kind of this dark red blood soaked robe that he's got now on one shoulder. <laughs> you for some reason hit the armored one. <laughs> wow. 
Yep. Hi. <laughs> Guess that ends my turn. <laughs> mark, off, mark off a bolt, please. Yep. Uh, are ya? Me. I will now pew pew the guy right in front of um, Eric. Okay. Or, you know, try to. Because we know my luck. Um. So, once again, it will be my short bow. And... That's a, that's a no. That, that's exactly like Kitty as well, which is annoying. <laughs> yep. yep. Did it both hit the same shoulder? <laughs> uh, no, it's just, I think it just... Because, obviously, technically, these are all kind of in combat, and it's not just you stand exactly five yeah, feet apart. Yeah, people are moving. Yeah. yeah. I think it's just that you're trying not to hit Eric, um, and yeah. obviously you fire, and the guy just steps out of the way in time. Sure. Yep, yep. Um, bonus action, moving, moving bonus action. Uh, A bonus move. A move bonus. I'll just move here. Yeah, okay. To see if there's anything from that side of the room, basically. Cool. Uh, That's me. Eric. Cool, right. I don't have many cantrips that deal damage. I have two. <laughs> have an AOE and a single target. It's more than simple. Um, it is. Um, I guess. Hmm, I don't want to do this. I'm going to try Shock and Grasp. That guy. What guy, sorry? Left? Yeah. Yep, cool. Yeah. Ooh, the boot works. You do not have. Just like, try to pound and just back up, backs up. I'm like, yeah, okay, maybe not. Uh, let me see if I can discern this two seconds. Shocking grasp. Or is this a specific piece of wording I need to read? Right, that's fine. Oh. Do I get it? He's wearing metal. Do I get an advantage? He's technically not wearing metal, so no, sadly you don't. <laughs> I, I aim for his shoulder. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's what I was checking. That is what I was yeah. checking. You don't get it, sadly. Be different if he had metal armor. He just doesn't have metal armor. Um, right, anything else you want to do? Move one to um, the left, I guess. Stay where you are. And then one back to the right. <laughs> Boop. Boop. That's like me stepping over. Zap. Nope. Step back. Now in America. Now in Australia. <laughs> um, Eric is done. Thus it is reached. Nice save. Alright, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah, I think they're still doing this thing. They're still some up the top. Okay. Right. Uh, I'm going to do the exact same as before, so right uh, quarter stuff the guy mm -hmm. tomorrow night, like, yeah. Uh. I was waiting on you rolling a seven. Oh, honestly was. Uh, <laughs> 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 uh, yeah. Well, yeah. he did twice. That is he good, did huh? twice. Yeah, he did. You rolled twice total, seven. yep. Yeah. yeah, he's yeah. gone. Yeah. Yeah, yeah like cool. you smack him across the head, he falls to the ground. Yeah. Punch him, it's just above yeah. me there. Uh. Punch. You miss. Is is aware you're punching shenanigans now? Oh yeah. Right, in turn. I, yeah, don't want to move or anything. So yeah, in turn. Okay, okay. I've noticed we can see each other's health bars again. Are we keeping that on now? Um, who even knows such things? It's maybe just the tokens that we're using. Um, Fair enough. So I had you guys on this map probably before I edited the tokens. So if you drag yourself. In fact, let me do it just now so you don't do it to somewhere you shouldn't. Where are you? So if I drag you to here, nobody else can see your health bar, I guess? I can see his health bar. Really? On here? Uh, yeah. I can see two of them now. Mm. I can see everybody's health bar. Hey. No numbers, but the health bar. Yeah, that's fine. Don't really care. Let's carry on. We'll deal with that later. That's a secondary concern. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yeah, the arm in front of us may be more primary. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, let's see. 
Um, I guess we'll start with the guy that spat blood, right? Because that seems important. Foupois! Nope. Oh, wow. Critical is field doesn't stop so himself. Bad. No, but I think it's just a case of, like, you, like, swing in with however you hit that guy that you take out. Mm. Um, and then you go to, like, punch that guy. He, like, goes back and goes to, like, pull his sword up, but then, like, you're like your staff's there and you kind of block one handed with your staff. Probably some kind of cool main character kata that's going on here. Yeah. Um, yeah. And then um, right, okay, so we're going to activate the nemesis system. So he has been pipped. That means if he ex escapes this fight, he levels up and comes back later as a problem. Um, and then um, <laughs> right, next guy next to you. Escape. For Nobody leaves the abyss, you know that. Um, does not hit you. God, these guys are shit. Um, Just call this place Hotel California. <laughs> uh, Eric. I think that hits you, doesn't it? Ooh. I... I've already got 12. Alright, you. Foie pois. Oh, cool. Woo, 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 woo. No, well, right. Yeah. Put it up to eat. Oh my god. <laughs> I had, I had in my head that it was 9, so I put I did minus 9 instead of minus 3. Can I move you to the front? Move that underneath you. There we go. Uh, right. And that was... 1, 2, 3... So I owe you one more. For pois. Wow, my rolls. Wow. Yeah, terrible, actually. <laughs> eh, it's good for you guys. And then... Yeah, it's good for us. Right, let's see. Probably to you for pois. That's gonna oh, hit. Okay. Meow. Mm, quite a big one. Wait, not totally speaking. Who did that hit? Me. Oh, there's a guy next. I can't even see you, but there, so. And then. He's probably going there for reach for pois. Probably nope. Still on uh, this. Yeah, I think because you're doing so well, that guy's going to join that f that team. Yeah. For pois. I think I'm dodging that much. Looks as though I'm, I'm having a game of Twister. Makes, here. It right. just makes you look super fucking kind of competent. It's that scene. Uh, is it the dojo scene in the Matrix? Isn't it? Yeah. Stop trying to hit me and hit me, but don't actually hit me. <laughs> 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 and then, yes, this guy's going to just. Head straight down there and join this this club. Oh, hey, dudes. Hey, I love how we've got a tank as a sorcerer. Yeah. yeah. I'm, I'm a melee sorcerer. <laughs> Not the best build. It's, a, it's just that I cast magic and people hit me in melee. That's what I mean. <laughs> um, Kitty. Well, I'm gonna drop my hand crossbow and pull out my rapier. And so the back one handed what to so drop it. Yeah, you don't need to drop, need drop it. it. Oh okay, well I'll just pull my rapier out and just go ham on this dude. Okay. Dear. For pie. Well, there's not for pies. So yeah, you for pie. He's for pie. Rapier. <laughs> yeah, rapier. I do love that rapier. it is called go rapier. Go rapier. <laughs> uh, it's there's no sneak attack on this, but it is a nine person. Yeah. Oh oops. Didn't know that sneak. It's Sorry. okay. So, describe how this guy runs to you, stabs you, and then you just kill him. Literally, he, he runs up to me out of the dark. Well, sort of out of the dark. I can kind of see a little bit. Mm -hmm. And he just sort of... I feel like he just sort of gets me in my shoulder, and I'm just like, huh. Mm -hmm. Ow. Stab. <laughs> yeah, like that kind of almost... As you recoil to grab your shoulder, you just pull this, like the rapier out to like smack his like scimitar away, and then as you do that, you just... I don't know, slash across his throat or something. <laughs> he walks into it. <laughs> <laughs> Please run into this kind, sir. <laughs> um, not bad. Not bad at all. Um, right. Uh, anything else you're doing? Um, You've got movement, right? Probably four days. <laughs> <laughs> no, I will, I'll, I'll stay where I am. I'm pretty happy, I think, with that. Um, yeah, it's alright. It's pretty good. Yeah, I could still hit a couple of guys on my next turn if they don't get. Literally deaded. still in the John Wick area of competence, so yeah. Yep. Mm -hmm. I'm good. I end my turn. Good, good, good. 
Hey, let's see. Me. <laughs> right. Me? So yeah, now we are on you. I was actually just checking a rule to see how loading works with crossbows. If she can still technically reload her hand crossbow with a rapier in her hand, but it doesn't actually say you can't. That I can see. So it just means that you can't fire it multiple times a turn unless you take crossbow export. So that's if fine. you just lab across it and like loads on the side, like next. Mm -hmm. uh, Arya, what you up to? Um, I'm still on the guy like that's above mm -hmm. Eric, right? Mm -hmm. And I'm still gonna try to pew pew him. Okay. Because why not? Nice. Oh, wait, huh? Yeah. Woo! Okay, so uh, damage. No, nice. he should be dead. No, should be. He's not. Where would he be? Oh. I think he's too busy trying to like stab the sorcerer, and then as he like lunges forward with his scimitar, then this arrow just goes. <laughs> and hits him in his shoulder. Mm. Arterial blood spray. <laughs> 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 I think I'm gonna <laughs> Oh, Eric, a new set of, set of ropes by the time we're done here. I'm just gonna give you a magic boar called transfusion, that's what I'm gonna uh, <laughs> Or see, or see if, like, mend, if the <laughs> mending spell thing can be used for, like, cleaning ropes. <laughs> so I prefer these ropes are kind of wrecked anyway from all, from the, light, uh, the fight with a dragon and multiple fights with... Okay, so I don't know you, that's fine, cool, bye. I mean, you got blue on it. <laughs> Uh, are you moving anywhere, or are you going to bonus action anything? Um... Yeah, actually I can move a little bit, so why not move a little bit? I'll move mm -hmm. a little bit Close No! <laughs> uh... I was just going with a song. Oh, no. Kitty's never said if there's like... A door or anything this way, so I'm just gonna be like <laughs> a handy one, exit with two, a neon sign. Three, four, <laughs> five, six. Just moving here. It's called stage right. <laughs> <laughs> whoa, 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 we're leaving me. Oh, my bear. To be fair, like she's just like annihilated a guy's artery. I mean, come on. Uh, you... Oh shit! I just realised I fucked something up by doing that. I don't know what my range is. Oh well, I moved already. Yeah, I was gonna say you're you're um, you're probably fine. I'm st I'm still within range. Okay, yeah. that's fine. That's fine. And keep in mind, in me, it looks like you just I can I can move and attack if need be. So yeah. Even if you like bounce <coughs> trick shotted your arrow that way, it would still be uh, normal. It wouldn't be a disadvantage. Um, what? No, you can't do that. Obviously. Um, <laughs> Big tricks, I think. Tricks are for kids. And then, uh, <laughs> what you could do though, you've still got enough economy. I don't know if you've got enough spell slots, but you've definitely got enough economy to uh, cast healing ward if you wanted. I could. Only if you would. Oh. <laughs> I know. Depends um, how much you like the cat. Yeah, I, I cannot actually see the cat's health, or is there a, is the dead body in front yeah, of it? Yeah, to be honest, Eric could use it, I think. Yeah, fuck it. I'll use my... My thingy. My bonus action. Do you oh, have yes, any spell I slots left? Yeah, because I've used the level two ones. I can use the the level mm -hmm. thingy. One second. I, I have as I have it in front of me. I won't sound like an idiot talking about it. Okay. So I still have my four remaining level one slots. I've cast uh, healing word before at level two, and I only have one slot left like that. Okay. And. To be honest, that sounds like the right thing to do, because... Actually, no, I'm going to save the level 2 slot. I will cast it as level 1. Okay. There's there's a logic here. No, it makes sense, yeah. Uh, on Eric, Th yeah. There is a logic here, I promise, yes. Cool. So you say um, Gizenheit in a yes. Elven. Yes, and he gets four, uh, four, four health. Cool, thank you. You're welcome. I can't see the cat's health, so I probably chose the wrong target for help, I don't care. To be fair, the cat's just like murdered a guy, so... <laughs> yeah, that, 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 that's basically it. I was like, yeah, she's she's well enough to do that. She's she's all fine, yeah. you know. Uh... She's all just a big mass of, like, fur and robes there just wrecking havoc and killing people. So. Yeah, and the turn order has cycled back around, so... Mm -hmm. How about we take a wee break? We'll take a wee ten minute break here, right? 
and then yeah, okay. we will return for the second half maybe with a Scott, maybe not. We don't know. I was wondering, yeah, yeah. can somebody please go give him a bucket of fuel? Yeah. yeah. Like, yeah. Uh, anyone watching this, if you have time travel technology, if you could go back, fix or lack of a paladin. Um, you know that <laughs> class that is a half-orc paladin DPS healing tank? If you could at all, that useful combat entity. Um, yeah. Anyway, join us for part two. See you every day in ten minutes. Goodbye. Bye. Bye. Bye.